Hey guys, so welcome to Abby's Auras or welcome back if you've been here before. Please make sure you're hitting that subscribe button and the bell icon so you don't miss out on any of my future videos. Okay, so this is basically my first time trying um, or doing a ritual. I've never done one before, but it just intrigued me. Um, I'm trying to do different techniques of manifestation. I want to embody more of the feminine side of the manifestation rather than the action. Uh, so I'm just going to do a, a ritual. Um, I've never even thought to do one before. I, I knew about them, but I've never been drawn to it. Um, and today I was. So I've just created a really nice atmosphere. I've got some nice healing music on. Um, I've got my crystals. Um, I've got a whole bowl of crystals. I've got my candle and my journal. Um, so what I'm basically going to be doing as I do my ritual is do, I've got my crystals that I love around me and I'm wearing them. I like music like this that's why I put it on and um, it just helps me feel connected and calm and um, when I'm connected to my spirit guides intentionally I always put this type of music on and then I personally love to journal that's why I've got my journal so what I'm going to do is going to use all of these things um, to basically make it fun and um, make it my own so i'm gonna call upon my spirit guides my um you know my archangel all the archangels or and my angels just basically what i call my spirit team because i feel like everyone just doesn't have a spirit guide we also have like our higher self the angels like um our spirit animals like we have so much around us and our loved ones you know but that we don't even utilize because the word spiritual guides or so kind of i feel like it just puts it in a box where i just want to be open to all of it so i call it my spirit team i'm just going to basically be calling on them to come down and assist me um i don't know if i'll include that bit but i'm just going to basically ask them to join me join me in this uh process and to basically take on what I'm manifesting and then let them do it because I know that we don't have to have um too much involvement some things definitely do take action but for me the things that I'm I'm already doing the action daily anyway that I need to be doing so I don't intend to be doing any more than what I'm already doing I just want um these things to start to flow to me um so yeah okay let's get into it so i'm gonna start by lighting my candle i love fire i know that might be a little bit weird but i think it's something to do with my star sign i'm sure um my partner said it's something to do with my star sign that i really love fire but i really love water too i don't know i'm not i'm not um too well versed in star signs but it smells amazing um so i've just burned a candle sometimes in the past i've burned if i wanted money then i've burnt like green candles as i'm just um doing work not in and in, in necessarily to attract money but i just thought oh like it'll be nice like because i'm attracting money right now like i've just done that but like you or you could do that for love because it's your heart chakra or you know whatever you feel like doing like personally this is just a yankee candle i got gifted to me um and that's why i'm using this um i would never think to get this scent but it actually smells quite nice but yeah i'm just gonna use this candle just because i've got it with me um but you you could actually you know use the candles that have the right color towards what you're manifesting and you could link it with your chakras so i am going to start by journaling um dear universe um or 
to your higher self as well because I, I really connect with my higher self. And then I'm going to just do a little bit of gratitude. journaling I did about four pages of just gratitude and feeling in the moment and um, I wrote most of it as what I've already got and I just wanted to give grat gratitude to what I have and I know that when you give gratitude more of it comes but honestly I, well, I'm not doing this to you know get loads of new things I just felt really like inclined to do it. I really I just really wanted to do this little practice and um, I am manifesting some more things but honestly I don't have any kind of it's just not no resistance really I don't have it on a pedestal I don't feel like I'm worried about when it comes or how it's gonna come. I don't really care. Um, I just know that it's already coming anyway. I don't need to do this to make it come, but I thought this would just be a nearly really nice little um, kind of ceremony and ritual to do um, and just be in my energy and be connected to my guides and my angels and all of that. So, if you're going into this just to get the manifestation, then it's just the wrong energy. But honestly, I'm just going with in with it, having fun and just, it feels nice to just like remind myself of all these amazing things. So now I'm actually gonna do a little meditation. I'm going to call in my spirit guides. Um, um, yeah, I might even just tell you what I'm gonna be manifesting, but yeah, okay. So I'm going to actually move this here because I like to sometimes, if I open my eyes, sometimes if I get distracted um, and open, I feel like I'm just sitting there. If I open my eyes and just stare at the candle, it's a little bit better because the flicker of the flame can get you into a meditative state too. So I'm just going to breathe. And, I, and then I imagine all of my chakras opening I imagine them as in their lotus flowers and they all blossom and open and that's how I connect with my spirit team so all of my chakras are now open and I'm just gonna go ahead and call in my spirit team so spirit guides with love and light please can you come down and assist me at this time also my angels my loved ones um, my mom, can I have anyone that's available really and that would love to assist me in my manifestations and my um, to guide me through this time of my life.
Okay, so that is my little, not really a prayer because it's kind of like just talking to your spirit team in, in more of a friendly manner. So more of just like they're your friend and they're your, they're your team, they're only working with you and they want you to succeed they want you to have everything that you want to because if you want it then that means it's just it's just connected to your true self so i just have chills i just feel good and i want you guys to feel good when you're manifesting i don't want you to feel like it's kind of like a must or a need like i really need this because you won't get it in that energy so if you go into the energy of feeling like this is fun and this is something new to do and it makes me feel happy, then do it because amazing things will happen. So just try and be more lighthearted about things and your manifestations. Try to just feel good in the moment because every time you smile and you feel good, you are in alignment, you are high vibe. So try and be in that momentum of things rather than the, where is it? It's not here. Is this gonna be enough? Am I good enough? Because all of that is rubbish. None of it is true and everything will always work out. So if you liked the video, then please give it a like. Comment below what you're manifesting um i might do a few different versions of these rituals because it was kind of just fun to just have me time and i thought if i'm already doing it why not make a video out of it and show you guys what i'm doing you know include you in a little bit more so i'm really excited to take you guys on the journey with me um i'm growing so much spiritually and I just kind of want to open myself up to share with you guys what I'm growing through um, because otherwise if I didn't learn from other people what they were going through and you know I wouldn't know that it's normal what, I, what I'm going through so I kind of would be more scared and more I wouldn't be as relaxed and more myself I think so it's nice to have confirmation from somebody else sometimes what you're going through is it completely okay so yeah i just want to share with you guys as i'm going through it and so if you want to see more then subscribe so you don't miss out and i will see you guys tomorrow